Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how we can use echo command in Linux and I'm also going to show you how we can declare variables and how we can use uh, these variables with our echo command. So let's get started. So first of all to use echo command you just use echo and then some text for example hello world and press enter and what it does according to its name it just displayed displays whatever you write after this echo command so it echoes anything which you write after this keyword echo right now you may say that it's good for nothing because it's just echoing whatever we write after this and uh, it's not really useful but the use of uh, this echo command comes when you are using some scripting for example uh, bash scripting and then it becomes really uh, you know important sometimes to use echo and maybe in the next video I will show you a brief introduction to uh, scripting also and then you will be able to understand how echo is important right so this is how you can use echo but there is a good practice uh, to use echo also which is you just use echo and then you use double quotes around your text or whatever you want to display so for example hello world again and then it displays the same com content but it's better to use uh, double quote around your text okay now how to use variables in uh, uh, terminal or in Linux so in order to declare a variable you just need to uh, give a name to your variable for example my var for my variable and then give equals to sign so it's important here to note that I'm not providing any space between the variable name and equal to symbol so don't provide any space in between okay and then give uh, any value to your variable for example I will give some name for example mark and when you press enter it does nothing but whenever you want to uh, you know know the value of this variable you can use echo so just write echo and then the dollar symbol so just use this uh, kind of uh, dollar symbol and then the name of your variable for example my wire okay and press enter and it will display the content of this variable right so what we have done here is we have uh, given some name to our variable and we have assigned some value to our variable using equal to and in order to display uh, the content of a variable you can use echo and a dollar symbol before your variable name and then variable name and it will echo the content of uh, the variable right now for example I can uh, declare some other variable also but before this I want to uh, let you know that this variable is only uh, valid for this session of the terminal so as soon as you will uh, you know close the terminal then your variable value will be gone right so it's only valid for this session of the terminal right now let's uh, declare some other variable for example x is equal to 10 which is an uh, integer for example okay and press enter and it does nothing and then we can echo something like this so echo and then uh, for example I will just write in double quotes the value of x is and then the dollar symbol and then the uh, name of your variable which is x right and press enter and what it prints the value of x is 10 which is the value we have assigned to our variable right so in this way you can uh, declare a variable and uh, you know echo its value using echo and these two things are really uh, important whenever you are uh, using uh, scripting right and that we will see in the next video now there are uh, some options uh, you can use with uh, echo so for example when uh, for example you want to escape something then what you can do so for example I will just use 
echo and then I will use minus E flag for escape and then I will use single quotes here and for example I will uh, say some text so some and I will just provide this for example backslash and then the next uh, word for example text okay and this will be escaped because we are using uh, minus e here and let's see what happens so once we press enter it gives the tab between the text so one thing uh, worth noting here is whenever you uh, will give this flag called minus e it will enable interpretation of backslash as an escape sequence and then you can use uh, different kind of uh, sequence something like for example backspace or uh, you can use a new line uh, you know escape sequence or you can use tabs as we have seen that it haven't printed some and then uh, text it has printed some and then ext because backslash t is for uh, tab in uh, for horizontal tab to be more precise and uh, uh, you know in bash scripting right so whenever you want to uh, use uh, you know backslashes or escape sequence you can use minus e as a flag right so let's see some other examples of uh, using this so i will just echo it once again and this time what i'm going to do is i will use uh, backslash n and then some text something like this and press enter and you can see it prints the you know text in the new line so you can see sum is in the first line and text in the new line after the space right or you can do something like this without space and press enter and you can see both are printed in the next line and uh, there are some more uh, you know sequences for example backslash b or uh, other sequences something like backslash a which is for alert or uh, some other uh, sequences which you can uh, you know uh, search for using man man pages and you will be good to go so this is how you can use echo and you can declare variables in uh, linux i hope you enjoyed this video please wait comment subscribe and bye for now